831 and developing now Baltimore's homicide count now 151 for the year after another deadly shooting overnight the latest around 10 p.m. on Douglas Court in southeast Baltimore. It was the third murder in the city yesterday alone. Since early Saturday, seven people have been killed in Baltimore. Many more have been hurt in shootings. That spike in violence coming as the police department faces a shortage of officers. Elijah Westbrook is here with a look at the tactic police commanders are now using to target high crime communities. Elijah? Yeah, that's right. Well, we're hearing Baltimore police may be short as many as 500 officers. But despite that number, they're moving ahead with a plan to target high crime areas right down to the block. It's called micro zone policing. Officers are required to spend up to 20 minutes per shift in several high crime communities. Council President Brandon Scott says he's hoping this new strategy will be implemented fairly. Right, we know that we don't want them out there doing picking on any, picking up anybody for anything. I want them focusing on the people that are committing the violence. Now, in a tweet, the Fraternal Order of Police questions whether the new strategy will be effective, especially with the department shorthanded by as many as 500 officers. Some on city council believe that shouldn't be an excuse. As it stands now, this new strategy will target more than 100 small areas of the city and in all of the police districts. Live here in studio, I'm Elijah Westbrook, Fox 45 Morning News. Thank you, Elijah. We